Please access another experience. Please enjoy your experience. Don't think about it too much, too much, too much, too much. This is more than just a new last for you. We are controlling the transmission. Welcome to the dawn. You have just accessed the beautiful experience. This experience will cover courtship, sex, commitment, fetishes, loneliness, vindication, love, and hate. Social media has gone way past just being social. It's now the biggest shift since the Industrial Revolution. YouTube is the second largest search engine on the internet. From help tutorials to today's news stories. Assisting in driving traffic to and from Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram, LinkedIn. In fact, the average adult spends over 15 hours per week online. One in five couples meet via the internet. 80% of United States businesses have a Facebook page. So it's pretty safe to say. Even if you say you don't do social media, social media is doing you. We welcome you to Media Handlers Social Media TV. Let me tell you the reason why white America has a problem. Uh, reason why white America has a problem, and before I get into it, let me just say this. I don't have a problem with white folks. <laughs> I got some white people that work for me. I got some white people that work with me. I, I find them to be very cool people. Peace and love, brothers and sisters. I'm, I'm making this video because I'm in deep thought right now. Um, with this whole loving, all loving Negro uh, campaign. I'm going to view my opinion and a lot of people may not like it. But guess what? I really don't care because I'm tired of the bullshit that is going on in the black community. Back in the building and holding it down. You know who you watching, right? My name is Danilo Ignacio. First, I'd like to say blessings to all the people that have definitely ingested what I've said, whether it hurts your feelings a little bit, because sometimes the truth hurts, on my Facebook page, urban, my urban channel page that we're doing. We are getting ready to relaunch our system solely because within the last year, more young, Urban people have died by the hands of white police officers than anybody else. But the problem that I'm having is we've got to learn to wake up. A lot of our brothers and sisters that have been born in this country have been hoodwinked and deceived to think that you come from Africa. You need to understand, claim your riches right here in America. If your mother and father was born here and you were born here, the riches of America belongs to you. We have a serious problem. And after these two years, whether you like Obama or don't like Obama, we have a case that the Republicans are coming in right now to overturn anything that he has done to help us. Anything that he's done to move America forward. These white supremacists, and I'm going to call it like I know it to be, and they call themselves the Republicans, have now taken over the system and they want to overturn what this man has done in the last six years. We have another two years in total. Good afternoon, everyone. I hope you guys are having a good day so far. <sighs> Today has been interesting, to say the least. Um, so what I wanted to talk with you guys about uh, is about a post that I did last night when I said, what if they, they mean, they meaning the powers that be, the powers that control the world, um, what if they gave a bunch of idiots millions of dollars <laughs> and positioned them as idols for the, um, you know what, not even just the black community, let's just say society as a whole. And we just was, you know, just relaxing, trying to get away, having a good time. And then the next thing you know, the Ferguson decision happens. Then the day I see the the 12 year old that's killed by the police. And man, you know, me having two boys, you know, I'm with my son right now, my wife and family there on a the beach run. And me having two boys, this is my youngest, you know, and to think that he could be in a park playing with a BB gun. I had a BB gun growing up, you know, an airsoft gun, whatever they call it. 
you know, I had the fake guns, you know, and used to be outside shooting lizards or, you know, shooting into the pond. And just to think that my son could have a fake gun, you know, playing with it when so many other little kids, you know, got guns and they're going hunting with their dad. Well, we could be out in the park playing with a gun and the police who was trained, who was experienced, who was an adult can pull up on my son and shoot him. You know, to think about that, to think about Mike Brown, you know, even if he had shoplifted. When I was 15, I got arrested for shoplifting. To think about the fact that when I was 15, when I was a teenager, had that cop pulled up on me with the wrong disposition, having a bad day, you know, just upset, feeling like he had something to prove, to think about that I couldn't be here that I might not be here today, that who I am today is who Mike Brown could be today. I reached 30 million people a week with my message. I never finished college, but I'm a husband. Please access another experience. Please enjoy your experience. Don't think about it too much, too much, too much, too much. This is more than just a new life for you. We are controlling the transmission.